Welcome to High Tech Pavilion. This is perhaps the CII's loudest, but also the most exciting pavilion. Now the biggest draw here are obviously the robots. Robots that can do everything from playing ping pong to making coffee and to ma managing production lines. But there are also companies here that aren't just about fancy displays. They are focusing on ways to solve problems we all face, like the COVID-19 pandemic. What solutions are they offering? Well, one American company called Johnson Controls has a few to share. Now to hear what they are, I'm now joined by the company's representative, Ms. Uh, Cheo Fei, Vice President of Government Affairs and Communications. So thank you so much for joining us in the interview. Well, we know Johnson Control makes giant chillers and offers uh, energy sufficient, uh, efficient solutions, but this time your company is also uh, making something related to human health. Tell us what it is and what's the technology behind it. Yes, so uh, uh, because of the pandemic, so we are promoting a series of products that uh, help our customers to provide uh, clean air, thermal cameras, and integrated uh, hospital solutions mm -hmm. to hospitals, schools, public places, airports. So uh, if you look behind me, for example, mm -hmm. this is a uh, thermal camera. Mm -hmm. And this camera is actually one of the only three brands that has been approved by FDA to be, uh, can be used in hospitals. What it does is it can um, detect temperatures of a crowd, as many as 30 people. Mm. And then if uh, you know, it uh, finds one person's temperature is higher than a set temperature, for example, 37.3 degrees, then the camera itself can send out alarm. Some experts have said the pandemic has accelerated the trend of smart manufacturing, uh, with many employing industrial 4.0 solutions. And that's because in the face of the diversity, smart manufacturing can bring tangible benefits, such as reducing human labor and thus facilitating social distancing, which is so important in controlling the pandemic.